after we arrived in Georgia. The vehicle's battery went dead on us while at the bank trying to get money. It was kind of perplexing as the battery was changed just last year in October of 2022, just eight months ago. So I called the AAA for battery service. The service rep came and changed the battery without checking the alternator. Thank God. Something caused the battery to die, I thought to myself. It's got to be the alternator and wasted no time the following day and I called the auto shop that has good reviews. The shop ran a test on the alternator and found it to be faulty. The alternator was changed then and the Highlander started right away. It sounded better and the dashboard lights are clearer. I knew it was the alternator because I have experienced it before with my own car. So that was our experience during our first week in Georgia. The work began at my sister's house. I was right after the July 4th holiday. We got important things done completed on the, on the third week of June. Renewed her government ID that was expiring. Scheduled a company to put a booth vent and recocking two vents on the roof. Things seems to be moving along, working in our favor. So now we are just waiting and looking forward for the major project to start. That day came and we also received a very sad news about my brother uh, passed away on that day. We were not expecting it as we thought he was getting better. So that was a very sad week for us. Today is Wednesday here and it's after the 4th of July and um, Lisa's uh, floor installation is being done today. And uh, the kitchen uh, floor is being changed to a uh, kind of a tiled to a tiled uh, flooring and the uh, people at people doing the carpet looks like they're almost done so um, now they're putting back the headboard and uh, looks like a clean carpet so we're changing I, I do vlog so I hope you guys don't mind. So now they're putting back the, the bed now, putting it back together. And I uh, thought I'll show you some work. This work being done today. And it's not leveled so that was leveled today and I'm glad it wasn't a big um, difference so it was worked on it was I think a cement was added to it on top of it so now it looks fine and it's now level um, the guy the foreman uh, just showed me so everything was good so now they're ready to lay the tiles in the kitchen floor and here are the workers um, the carpet uh, putting back the the mattress the mattresses and all the furniture is back into the bath into the bedroom uh, right now that's what they're doing and here's Lisa just watching TV <laughs> and it's a mess here totally a mess everything is everywhere we just put everything everywhere And the floor that we have in the kitchen, um, it looks bigger now and it's lighter. Uh, it seems to light up the whole uh, kitchen uh, because it looks almost white with a light gray color. So they're finishing, doing the finishing touches and putting the, the sideboards and more base there. Um, the floor is looking better. We had to empty all the counters. So that's the new floor, Lisa's new floor. And uh, Lisa is happy about the new floor. She liked it and because it was a lot better than before. We're getting hungry because we haven't eaten. The guys have been working since this early this morning. 
so I'll update you again later okay we're probably gonna go eat out after this uh, see you later bye